guys, welcome back to the world of two houses. Um, I'm not sure what today's video is. Uh, I just got back from Pets at Home and bought a few things, which I'll show you now. Okay, so the first thing is I bought some yogurt drops. It says for hamsters, gerbils, mice and rats. I got them from Pets at Home. what that is i don't know whether that's a crack i'll see but my guys it's not a hole it's just where they didn't put the pink stuff on it properly uh you may have seen these in my other videos they're yogurt drops suitable for hamsters gerbils mice and rats it's for a nice treat or reward as you can see they'll like them very very much but make sure not to give them too many otherwise they will become fat I've got is a wooden garland. This is suitable for Syrian hamster, rabbit, gerbil, guinea pig, jigu, mouse, rat, chinchilla or a dwarf hamster. If it's like this that means they can't have it but if it's like this they can have it and if you have any of these animals you can get it and of course that's a ferret but you can't get it for, for a ferret for some weird reason. It says, easy to fit, hangs from most wire homes, encourages natural behaviour, helps satisfy a natural desire to chew. I also got this, uh, a new water bottle for them, because my old one didn't work as well and it kept leaking. This is a rabbit one. It's very big. You have to fill it up with fresh water every day. It's meant for rabbits, but I got it for my rats instead because I find that will be better and it would hold more water than it did for my last one. I will be cleaning out my rats. Um, as you can see, it's quite dirty. I only cleaned them out yesterday, but unfortunately I didn't get a chance to show that because I had to do it in a certain time. And um, I'm going to put in the new things. I like the toys, uh, the water bottle, and put a new few things in there. I also got a few other things to show you, which I'll show you in a minute after Bert's finished drinking. This was the old water bottle, as you can see the size difference. There is quite a big difference, this one's quite small. This used to be my old rabbits, but now I've got a new one, which is also for rabbits. Then next we have a plain chocolate orange box. Luckily it's empty because all the chocolates are gone. But make sure there are no chocolate crumbs in the bottom. Otherwise, they will eat it, and I'm not sure what will happen. We've got some monkey nuts in here. A few balls and toys. Another sock. It's an old sock, by the way, guys. It's not one of my socks that I wear every day. Another sock. Uh, some balls that I showed you in my some of my previous videos. Um, a rolly round toy, which I also showed you in my previous videos. Um, a fluffy pom pom toy. Most of these I showed in my previous videos, so I'm going to put these back in. Like so, and then I'm going to get the other things which are also on top of the rat cage, which I'll show you in a minute. Yesterday I filled up this uh, container with their food, because they did run out of it. So I had to fill it up again with another bag like so then I just undo it take a scoopful and pop it into their food bowl just over there okay guys I just filled this up but I rinsed it before because I didn't want 
there to be any dust in there because in some shops when you buy water bottles there is some dust in there so you always rinse it before you use it and now I'm just going to clip it on the cage with this what I'm going to do is take out the bowl right there yes okay now the bowl is out and I'm just going to spray it with some disinfectant just along the bar so it doesn't get sticky Okay guys, I sprayed it with the disinfectant and clipped on the water bottle. As you can see, it took me quite a few seconds to get this on because it's new. Hopefully, they will use it. Because they did use the other one and rats also drink a lot of water. And I'm going to start cleaning them out in a minute. Once I've cleared up all of this. And I'm going to put this in the cage and give them a few of these. Um, that video was from a couple of weeks ago. I just decided to, to carry it on from here because they do need to be cleaned out today. Um, as you can see, it's very messy. Uh, I last cleaned them out a couple of days ago. It's quite messy. Oh, I put the wooden garland in, as you can see, and the water bottle. And the yogurt drops are just up here, and the bowl is there. So all I need to do is put these wooden things out, um, and then they can come out. Okay guys, it's now later in the day, um, I'm sorry that I didn't get to record the shelves being put in and being showered or putting the new toys and things in, um, but I did have fun doing it. Um, can you comment down what you would like me to do in my next video and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!